What is going on everybody and welcome to another Minecraft command block tutorial video. Today I'm going to show you guys five command blocks that you want to have on your realms or your servers on the Bedrock Edition. This is some of the server commands that you guys are definitely going to want to be able to add. Uh, and it's only six command blocks. The first command is actually two command blocks. It, it, they go with each other. The rest are all put into one command block. So you only need a total of six command blocks to make your server really more realistic for like uh, PC servers and just to be a better off uh, realm slash server. Uh, so I'm going to go over. You can see that I can't hit anything. I can't kill this mob down here. I can't break any block and I'm in adventure mode. So I can't do anything. Basically, I can't PvP. I cannot do anything and I cannot take damage. So uh, I also cannot, if I come up here, I cannot fly hack. So basically, if you're higher than four blocks, which most servers you're not going to be having, a, unless you have a parkour, which then you can exclude that area. But you want people to not be able to fly hack. I got you covered on that as well. And if you have any damage taken, so I'm going to come over here to this uh, slime here. Here. Oh, and now you see that I can now PvP and my game mode is put into survival. Uh, and if I come over here and I take a couple hearts of damage, let me go ahead and take another. Uh, there we go. So if you take some damage or you somehow take damage inside your spawn and you want people to be able to be full health when you're in your spawn, full hunger and everything, you could all do that. So yeah, I'm going to show you guys exactly how to do that with these few command blocks. So I'm going to go ahead and go into creative and I'm just going to show you guys the ones you're going to need to know. So it's going to be a game mode. It's going to kill entities like TNT. So if you do take TNT, it does work as well. So we're just going to grab TNT and then we're going to grab ourselves a flint and steel. And I'm just going to show you flint and steel. Uh, you basically can't destroy anything around here, so I'm just going to activate it, and it immediately destroys. Can't do anything. Uh, also, fly hack, like I said, if you're in survival, which most people, they'll be in survival when they're doing fly hacks, uh, because of the commands, we'll be putting them in adventure or survival, and then you're good. Uh, as well as no PvP and never dying in your spawn. So this is great for spawn server commands. So, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. The first one here is going to be executing at all players that have a mode of survival within a 10 block radius. Now you can change the radius to 100, however big your spawn is. This is what you're going to want to do here. Uh, and you're basically going to change their game mode to A, which is uh, adventure mode. Uh, now the one above it is basically the exact same thing, but you're going to do an RM11 and R equals 12. So you're going to go up to uh, RM is basically one more than what your radius on the first command was. And R on this one is one extra over the RM. So just keep that in mind. So if you had 100, you'd make it be 101 uh, and 102 or something. So And you're just changing the game mode to S and you're, anyone that's in a game mode of A uh, is going back to S. So basically uh, anybody within 10 blocks of uh, the command here will be in adventure and then if you run over here if you're in game mode a and if you run over here you're immediately turned back to survival without having to test for anything or like that it's just automatically going to do it uh, now going on to the third one this one is a little more complicated depending on if you have a um uh, just different stuff inside of your servers or anything like that. This one's basically going to be killing at uh, any type of non-player, any type of not a villager, not a cow. So any mob that's not these three, which is a player, a villager, or a cow, will immediately die inside your spawn. So that's getting out of creepers. Now, if you don't want... Um, I'm, most people will have cows and pigs for like a farming area inside their spawn so you could do type equals not a uh, pig as well a chicken uh, but basically you want to do something like this so that your villagers for your shops are, are still safe uh, your cows can be in your realm you're on your server spawn uh, you could kill them players could kill them and interact you can make it to where uh, they could go over there and uh, uh, enable pvp um with command blocks, you could change some stuff. You could do whatever you want with this one, but this is how you keep hostile mobs out. If you wanted just to target hostile mobs, you could do type equals creeper. Uh, instead of the not here, you could actually do type equals a creeper. Uh, other than that, you could go and uh, come up here to this one right here. This one's going to be executed all players. Uh, M equals A, and uh, this one's going to be within a 10 block radius, and it's going to detect if there's four blocks of air below you. If there's four blocks of air, now you can change this if you want. It's basically going to say you're either parkouring or you're hacking. If you don't have any parkour in your server uh, realm, uh, spawn area, it's going to teleport you back to the spawn. Now you can change the coordinates because it's going to TP at P back to the actual uh, main coordinates. So you could teleport them to a prison or a jail area. Basically say you're you're flying, you're fly hacking, get off my realm or server. Uh, and then now this one over here is going to be affecting all players with strength 1, 2, 55. This makes it to where, and, and, and it's going to be M equals A, so anyone that's in adventure mode, which is basically within the 
what you should be with your inside your server uh, spawn. Now this one, it, it basically makes it to where you can't hit anything. You can't attack anything. It basically disables uh, PvP. Um, so yeah, it's pretty good. Now this one over here is basically giving everybody a instant health of 255 every second. So it's really hard to die inside your actual spawn. Uh, like I said, if you fell from like 40, 50 blocks, of course you're going to die. Um, but the fact that they shouldn't even be up there anyway uh, just proves that, you know, They'll be teleported way before because of the fly hack one and uh, won't kill them. So uh, that's pretty much it, guys. If you did enjoy this, remember to leave a like. Comment down below if you want to see any more server command types things. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!